Hey, how's it going guys? My name is Dom and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how easy it is to detect either portrait or landscape mode in the browser using JavaScript. Now, this solution is going to work on uh, desktop, but more importantly, it's going to work for your mobile devices and tablets. Now, the solution I'm going to be showing you today is not only going to be how to figure out what mode the user is currently in, but we're also able to react to when the user switches modes, which is probably more important anyway. So you can run whatever code you want once we figure out if the user's in portrait or landscape mode. So how do we go about doing this? Well, I'll drop down here within my script tags and we're gonna figure out that simple true or false. Are we in portrait or landscape? Let's say right down here, const and call this constant portrait equal to then we're going to be using something called window.matchmedia so this right here is going to be a cross browser solution so i'll just say here window.matchmedia and then we're going to pass in a media query the media query in question is going to be placed within double quotes and we'll just say here orientation colon portrait so basically what's happening here is we are testing if this media query is currently true. So does this currently match? Okay, so are we currently in orientation of portrait? That's what we're checking for here, okay? But we do need to say dot matches and that right there is our Boolean true or false. So basically if this right here is true, we are in portrait then this matches is gonna give us true. So now I can just say console.log portrait just like this. I'm gonna save this and go inside the browser here. I'll do a refresh and you can see here we get true. Okay, let's expand the screen a bit more just like this. And then I'm gonna refresh the page and we get false. Okay. So we can see as I switch from portrait to landscape, that value has gone from true to false. Let's go inside the mobile view. Okay, I'll try it again, refresh, we get true. It's a portrait screen. I'll rotate the screen here using that button and I'll do it again and we get false. So that is your simple true or false. Are we in portrait or landscape? It's that simple line of code right there. Now, what about detecting changes? This right here is also very straightforward. Let's remove this code here. In fact, let's remove all of this except where it says window.matchmedia. So we're gonna get rid of this dot matches and instead say dot add event listener. Then we're gonna say change just like this. Then hop down here inside the listener. So right here we are saying, look, if the orientation of portrait changes, then we're gonna run this function. So this is where you're gonna to wanna to put your code, which you know uh, does certain things based on portrait or landscape mode. And we can detect this by saying once again, const portrait is equal to this time saying E dot matches. So it's a very similar setup as last time, but now we're using E dot matches as opposed to of course the match media and so on. Now we can just say, look, if portrait, okay, I'll just say alert, you are in portrait. Okay, and then of course else, and do the exact same thing this time for landscape. So once again, guys, you can of course add your own code inside this if statement. I'll save this, go back in the browser, refresh here. I'm now going to flip the orientation and we get you are in portrait. Okay, I'll do it again you are in landscape. So right here, I'm just simulating what your user might do on their phone as they rotate their screen in. That's basically it guys. So once again, using window.matchmedia, I'm gonna be leaving documentation for this down below if you're interested. And that is all for today's video. So I hope you guys enjoyed that one. If you did, make sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in the next video.